Hey guys, welcome back to another Red Beard Outdoors episode. Today, we're running the Open Derby here at Boonville, Arkansas in our National Irish Setter Championship. So, we have a lot of dogs entered and um, I try to get as much footage as I can. It's worth a while, but it is a derby, so uh, we'll see what happens. I got Neo that I'm running and then Kelly's running a bunch of other ones, so uh, we'll see how that goes. Maybe I'll run another one too, I'm, I'm not sure. So I'm definitely running Neo and um, I'll see you guys out on course. And this year's 2021 National Championship. Tell me how much time we have. What, how much? One minute. Oh, I better break her away. I'll finish. All right, I'm sure. Pick them up! Thank you, sir. Thank you. Kelly. <laughs> Kelly. What? What? You gonna smile? Of course, Mark just photo bombed you. He's up front! Here! Here! <laughs> 
The dogs are ready. Right on this branch right here. About eight feet from my feet, it's pale. Yeah. Right on that pine tree. You can see it real good right here. I think there's there's two different ones. I'm really not sure what the judges called on this, but I don't think they seen the dogs point the birds. So in this next scene you're about to see Erie. Um, time was called and we found her at breakaway and she was pointing a bird. Uh, so unfortunately this didn't count, but I thought it was pretty cool to watch. Right here, Kelly. Is there a bird? So that was Boo's bird find, and Pence saw it and decided to chase it about a mile away. <laughs> Not literally a mile, but uh, pretty long ways away, and I had to go get her and bring her back. She, she'll do it for about three minutes and then she better stop. What's that? Neo. She's going to be fun. She's going to be fun, but it, you know, you get that. I want to handle her. I want. But he had, you know, he's, 
He was so nervous. Okay, just let her throw water in, so give her a second. How much time? Go I'm a little frustrated right now because Neo didn't find birds, but she ran really well for not finding birds. She started to get bored and kind of didn't know what we were out here for after a while, after, you know, not being able to find birds. So it's kind of unfortunate and I'm a little frustrated about it, but overall she ran really well and ran the course pretty good. So fortunately no birds. On to the next dog. Put your head that way, not towards the sky. You ready? Yeah. Good luck, Mark. Hammer's ready. Ready, sir. Yep. Let him go. I think he's up front somewhere. I did a barrel roll. It'll be on camera then. Yeah, yeah probably. <laughs> It'll all be on film. We can watch it later. <laughs> uh, it's a good tuck and roll though. What happened? Hole. Hole? Yeah. Hole, beer, ibuprofen. Put yeah. some dirt on it. You'll be fine. Huh? <laughs> Imagine what it's like running across the ship. I kind of just felt it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I got little bleeds. Give them to me. And 
Tara went down. What? So me and Tara went down. I can't hear you. Me and Tara went down. Are you okay? I thought y'all said you had it. A little bit, yeah. What happened? I thought they Huge hole. Up front. Okay, so it was a hole. In the yeah, a big hole. Where was that? Right in the middle of that field. So you're okay? I got cut up a little bit. Is she okay? I don't know. Is she limping? No. I did a barrel roll, landed on my back and rolled. But you're okay. Yeah, I mean, I got stabbed by a bunch of sticks. But, okay. Yeah. So if anyone was to hit that hole in the ground, I guess I'm glad it was me because Kelly just messed it right there. The judge just missed it right there, and then I go into it. So that was the first time I've ever fell off my horse before. I would have to say it was pretty graceful, nice little barrel roll that came out of it. Although I landed on a bunch of uh, mowed sticks and brush and whatnot, so that kind of hurt. At the time, uh, my back didn't hurt, but I woke up the next morning and it got pretty, pretty darn stiff. Um, so the rest of the Boonville trip, my back was pretty sore. But for falling off a horse, that was a good experience in my book. So my camera wasn't running, but the judges did a callback and they asked for Neo to come back first. So it's on Neo to point this bird during the callback or they're going to go to the next dog after me. So let's see if Neo points a bird right here. And this is probably for a placement, so hopefully she, she does what she's supposed to do and points this bird. Yeah, just drop it. Just drop, just it. drop it. I got it. Just drop it. Don't let her go down that line. Oh, she. Fine now, kid. That a girl. Right. Did she pretty point at all? Good. Yeah, she was pretty. Perfect. There's, there's a feeder right there, Kelly. If you never knew that. Oh. That pine tree right there. Yeah. There's a feeder right there. Oh well, there we go. I'm sure no one noticed it, but she found another bird right there. <laughs> Other than catching her. Yeah. <laughs> She's going to be geeked now. We can pony your horses. We can pony your horses if you guys want to. We're happy to do that, side. gentlemen. So Thank you for. I'll just that. It. All right. <laughs> so she pointed it? She pointed dice. Okay. Yeah. She I was there for I couldn't 10 see. seconds. Okay. She's fine. Come on up! Yeah, I couldn't tell first and I swung to the right from where I was. Let's give our nurse a place in the right? So, uh, here we have fourth place. Neo.
Oh, you're talking to Clayton or the dog? Smile at me. <laughs> smile at me now. We got a tongue hanging out, but. <laughs>